sky is the limit for unmanned systems at CES 2016. We have a record number of companies, manufacturers, stakeholders, and supporters. 27 exhibitors spend more than 25,000 net square feet of exhibit space in the unmanned systems marketplace. A reflection of the skyrocketing popularity and growth of commercial and consumer drones. They're super fun to fly and, and the, the benefits that they, they provide are, are unbelievable, um, especially in things like aerial photography, surveying and mapping. Um, the, the applications are really endless. CTA Market Research reported that roughly 400,000 drones were sold this past holiday season. And U.S. sales in 2016 will reach 2.8 million units. What you're seeing right here is a consumer level drone that's under 25 pounds that can interoperate and lift mirrorless cameras and DSLRs for the first time ever. Even the A7 Sony here that is about four pounds, we can lift this and still have about 12 to 15 minutes worth of flight time. This is the XT Flyer. It is a self writing aerial drone. And one of the most unique features on this is the geometry of our frame. If this drone hits a wall, hits a tree, or anything, it will automatically self-write. So we don't have to worry about having to intervene uh, to get it going again. The Consumer Technology Association expects for the U.S. to reach 1 million unmanned aircraft flights per day within the next 20 years, if the policy environment is right. Separate research says the drones market will drive the creation of more than 100,000 jobs over the next decade. Flying is a whole new take on the drone design. We wanted to build something that is safe for humans, uh, so you can fly the drones close to people. So we've built a, a spherical flying machine with a single propeller, fully enclosed, so you can touch it without hurting yourself. ExoPlus is the first fully autonomous drone to the market. This is really about capturing you and your adventure without the need of somebody else to fly it. So it's really something you can do on your own with no or very limited uh, prior experience with drones. A 39% revenue growth is projected for unmanned systems by the end of 2016. Continued popularity could easily see revenue exceed $1 billion within five years. We're really excited to be promoting the No Before You Fly campaign. You've got all these great drone manufacturers around um, trying to get the, the right information into the hands of consumers so they know where they can operate and, and fly safely and responsibly. Unmanned systems are taking flight at CES 2016. For CES TV, I'm Justin Siraj.